Child Sexy Red is out here putting her baby daddy on blast after he accused her of giving him an STD. Going on with you, do you tell him to burn it or do you lie to him like you did me? Or did you, or did you, or is you lying to the how you did me? Okay, so this whole narrative of Sexy Red being nasty and having STDs is back again. And this time, it's her baby daddy putting her on blast for giving him an STD. Child, this one is messy, so let's get into it. So, this whole thing kicked off and Sexy Red's baby daddy, a man known as Rutu Breezy on Instagram, called her out for giving him an STD. He took his IG stories to leak a recorded conversation between her and him where she admitted to giving him an STI, saying, everybody getting burnt. What's going on with you? Do you tell him to burn it or do you lie to him like you did me or did you or did you or is you lying to the how you did me or is you lying but that wasn't all. In the audio, Rad's baby daddy could be heard trying to press her about it, asking why she lied about having it and why she didn't tell him she had it, saying things like, when you gonna keep it gangsta? But the entire time, Rad's voice could be heard in the background and she was just cussing him out. Did you lie to me? Did you lie? Did you tell him the truth? Would you tell him the truth? When you gonna keep it gangsta? Hey. And when you gonna keep it gangsta? one clip she denied lying to him about it and he called her out again saying that's exactly what she did but y'all red did not sound like she was sorry at all she was cussing him out for real wishing even more diseases on him when you gonna keep it gang I, you you bit you did, that's what you did you lied to me for six months and then you told me you had that shit. For the caption on IG, he wrote, Y'all favorite rapper. She said she burning, everybody getting burnt. You gotta be strong for that and offside peak. Cause it ain't for the weak and I'm the weak. He later added, Remember, you started this. Now the drama ain't stopped there. Now the baby daddy went live on IG to explain how everything went down because the fans had a hell of questions for him. He wrote, Hold on, y'all. I'm finna go live in a hot second. Don't go nowhere. I got the answers. And he wasn't playing, y'all. He really got up on live and explained it all. He explained the SD she had, how it works, and the part that pissed him off the most is the fact that you can't get rid of it once you get it. My HSV 2 type 1 or 2 work, this is how this shit go. You can't get rid of that shit. If you f somebody that got this shit, Yikes, the fans had a lot to say about this one and none of them were surprised. Most of the fans already saw this coming and none of them had sympathy for the baby daddy because he should have known. Fans were saying things like, I mean, STDs are a part of her brand, you made that choice. And while well, your first clue might be that she has a lip gloss named Gonorrhea, <laughs> this other fan said, yelling about keeping it gangster whilst recording a private phone call. Dude, if she burnt you, the F you want us to do about it. Go get that penilicin shot and leave us out of it. Okay, so the word is part about this whole mess is that this is not the first time that we've heard about Sexy Red. Remember how Charleston White came out to accuse Sexy of giving him something similar when they were together? Now, we're hearing that one of Sexy's sneaky link, Gucci third leg, has been out here spreading the same infection to all the women he's been with. Okay, so in case you don't know who Gucci third leg is, he is an internet personality and a famous OF creator. This entire mess kicked off when a former collaborator of Gucci third leg, Donna Davis, dropped a bombshell on TikTok, accusing Gucci of giving her hate hsv2 without ever telling her that he was infected and what makes it worse is that she was only 19 at the time and that's not all according to donna gucci said like knew about his diagnosis the whole time but stayed quiet adding that he was out here exposing dozens of women to the same thing on purpose it's devastating to have to come out here and share that whenever i was 19 years old gucci third leg <laughs> Burn me with HSV2. And guess who got with Gucci third like right after Donna dumped him? That's right, Sexy Red. This had fans speculating that Gucci was the one who gave it to Sexy Red and she was then out here spreading it as she pleased. So if you're wondering why no one is surprised about the allegations, it's because this is not the first or the second time she would face such allegations. That's right, multiple people have accused her of being dirty, nasty, and have STDs. Even she confirmed that she had caught an STD twice at some point. Check this out. I got a real twice. <laughs> no, I ain't Great. never had. I had chlamydia before though twice. Okay, but I, I mean, never had that's the most pretty common. common. Yeah, TV. very common. She then went on to explain what happened, saying that she and her man were together, but then they broke up, and then both of them were in the streets, and they were not protecting themselves. So when they got back together, they found out they had it. This what happened. Me and my n together, mm -hmm. and we broke up because he was cheating on me. So then we broke up. Then I went and did me. <laughs> and oh, then shit. he did him. 
And so what did Sexy have to say about all of this? Well, she denied it, but she don't care because she knew fans were just going to believe anything they saw on the internet. Y'all wanna know why I don't care? One, it's not true. Two, y'all believe anything on this app.